Federal High Court in Abuja has expressed plans to shift the venue of the trial of Namde Kano, the detained leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB. Politics Nigeria gathered that this was to ensure the non interruption of other cases pending in court. It's common knowledge now that security operatives bar lawyers from accessing the court anytime Kano's case com comes up for trial. Speaking on the matter while receiving newly elected executives of the Abuja chapter of the Nigeria Bar Association earlier this week, the Chief Judge of the Federal High Court, Justice John Tosho, disclosed that an urgent solution to the issue must be found. It is a worrisome development to all of us, the courts, council, and parties. It is not really the making of the courts. It is something foisted on us. It is security arrangements that causes this problem. Of course, that has been necessitated because of the multitude of those who also want to witness the trial. So you find a situation where a trial is coming up involving an individual and a whole lot of communities leave their businesses to besiege the courts. It is worrisome, but you can't prevent them. So how to manage it has been challenging to us. We are even trying to think of some solutions. If you observe, for those who were there on Wednesday, the matter came up. But of course, the roads were free because the matter was shifted to late afternoon. So the security operatives were advised not to close the access roads to the court until the time proximate to the trial. We are improving along the line. We are actually solving the problem what we ultimately happen is that we are exploring the possibility shifting the venue of the trial that will be the best way out exactly that would be the best way out otherwise if the trial continues here it will interfere with our business we have 11 courts here but it is only one court that is trying cano anytime the case comes up the other courts cannot function it is really not a good development but I can assure you that we have actually gone far in finding a solution to it, he stated. <laughs> so that's to tell you how important uh, Namdi Kano's case is. How important is that if there's any, the day will be fixed for, the, for his trial, that a whole community, they leave their businesses. Of course, according to law, you can't, you can't, you can't, you can't chase them away. And you must allow them. <laughs> so when namdi kano case is being scheduled that means every other court around that place will not even they will not be able to do anything because of the crowd so they are looking for another venue hmm. okay and they tell you that hey, this guy is not special okay hmm. and you people are not ashamed of kind of stupidity act yet you claim to be independent don't worry by the time next year i will personally ask you people how market you think that nigerians are fools abi very soon the youth will remember people like you in judiciary continue to adjourn his case and continue to give in into all um excuses or executive bidding one day it will be your turn remember you people in the judiciary will be you will receive the fruits of your propaganda and labor okay this person is saying it from a different perspective that it might not really be what people are really thinking ordinarily. You are not holding Namde Kano hostage with your business charges, but you are holding the Biafra country or nation hostage. Wherever you take the trial to, the Biafrans will still besiege that vicinity. So the absolute solution, until the absolute solution uh, is to quash, to quash the business charges and set Kano free. You are feeling that you are dealing with an individual. Change your mindset, okay? You will not deal. You are not dealing with individual. You are dealing with a nation. You are dealing with Igbos. You are dealing with the youth. Trial of just one man. They cause all the jam. This is wonderful. That is my own point of view. Trial of only one man no, is turning everywhere upside down. Hmm. These people have ulterior motive. Quote me. The judgment will not be in favor of Kanu. They are afraid of people's reaction. On the concluded judgment on April 8th. That is why they are talking of venue shifts. 
all this while the court has been sitting it is now you want to change the venue i smell bad judgment no need of shifting the case to another place if you people are sincere caution the dss to stop their oppression and activities around the court premises may god destroy any evil plan against namdekanu in the mighty name of jesus all we want is the truth and nothing but the truth please nigeria should think about this upon the old charges against namdekanu it is obvious that nobody have mentioned that president buari is cloned now afulani kabaz are afraid of the escalation of that vital points because nigeria excluded is whenever they are counting the insult from namdekanu to ogabuari of nigeria where utmadan fodio said truth is an open wound only conscience can heal it all arms of government must find courage to stand in defense of truth yeah namdekanu represents the conscience of a dying society on see the truth of what produced him and is like this country we never know peace we have embarrassed ourselves in kenya bene republic for igbo how long would a country flounder before it lands to walk on sure-footed feet the court must give up to its supposed rule as the last hope of the masses every month news we don't tire different different things they don't have what it takes because i don't know why they cannot judge the case at once they are just going by this going by that going by this at the end of the day before you could say jack robinson they will adjourn the whole thing they will adjourn it why are you still keeping the case discharge discharge him and let him go please let's set aside this case of namdekanu for national unity and address causes of agitations in the country like i've always said eh the eh, ipop and whatever you are you are shouting ipop here and there you are shouting their names i mean why what they are shouting for they are fighting for themselves you are there you are not fight, you don't know nobody is fighting for you you are still supporting the politicians the government that is still suppressing you that is still oppressing you and you call that words i don't understand let people not come together things have gone out of hand as we speak <laughs> only god knows what will not happen but as we speak not that oh things are getting out of hand things are not getting out of hand things have already gotten out of hand it's out of hand already and people don't want to learn people don't want to know we are all in this together unfortunately i pray that may uh, people survive this because those who think that they have power they careless they are not bothered so guys leave your comment down there below and let's have your take on this new development from the court